Hey boys, welcome back to uh, Ro <laughs> Roos's career mode. I forgot what it was for a second there, but Roos's career mode. And it is a finals round three, which is actually the grand final of the Auckland Nines here. Taking on the Canberra Raiders, who have a uh, a pretty good side. We'll see. I think it's pretty much full strength as we look at it right here. It's pretty decent. Uh, I think the main one missing was, I know, Caesar. Caesar was on the bench for some reason. They got Sam Williams starting, but very strong side. So it's going to be a tough game, even though I will be honest. Uh, the Nines is pretty pretty easy to win, in all honesty. As uh, with a few passes coming together here, probably should just take it, take him to the line with someone. It's eventually Ferguson who gets held up, but maybe a couple too many passes. We had a couple of gaps open up, but just trying to just trying to find that ideal target as a little chip kick on four tackle or last tackle and uh, Daniel Tupo gets uh, held up again so the Raiders are sustaining a little bit of pressure but uh, able to thwart that uh, beautiful pass there Cody Nicarima on the end of it was tackled though I think it might have been Austin made the covering tackle or else he was away for the away for the prize there's a nice little inside ball out to Daniel Tupo one on one with the fullback and uh, Jack Wine it is it was one of those times where whenever they're close to the goal line like this, the, the fullback just goes way over the sideline. Or was it Blake Austin? Why is Blake Austin at the fullback there? I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know why, I don't know why Austin was at the at fullback, but uh, he was, and Daniel Tupo, one-on-one. -on -one, bit too hard to handle, and Cody Nicarima swings that one round nicely. 6-0. Six, six, uh, six minutes in this game, gone. As uh, who was this? Paul Vaughan straight through, and the big fella scores a very soft try. Mitchell Pierce here gets been one on one, and then he just runs straight around Cody Nicarima, and a uh, pretty pretty disappointing try to concede. But you know that's that's what happens in nines. You know a lot of one on one uh, opportunities, and uh, if the tacklers aren't quite on the money, then they're gonna be in a bit of trouble. But a good ball there, Cody Nicarima gets it back to Mitchell Pierce. He just lost all his momentum. He couldn't get the momentum, and he was uh, tackled by the Raiders player. Otherwise, it would have been he would have been away right there. I, I reckon Pierce probably would have streaked away and scored. He's pretty quick in this game. I think he would have been away, but the momentum was just gone. The pass pass was fine, but it just sort of it sort of just broke down. But it should be should be the last play of the game here. Nine minutes to go. Cody <laughs> Graham just standing, waiting for the boys to get back on side, trying to little set something up as Ferguson. Takes him on here, but a big shot coming in. I think Austin is playing fullback, so <laughs> I think it's just I think it's just the way Big End has sort of done the uh, done the teams or the the way that the teams pick their plays. It's a bit stranger than nine, so that's probably probably why. Because um, uh, I think Jack One was in the team, so it's a little weird. But uh, Austin Austin probably wouldn't be a bad fullback. Thinking about it, you know, five eight. 5'8 sort of pretty similar to fullback at the end of the day, but a kick out there, and it's Penny Terrapo, the new recruit, is going to go over for a very simple, very simple try. A good, uh, good bomb here by young Jaden Nicarimo, pinpoint accurate, and uh, who was that? Ferguson gets a bat down, and all the Raiders played just, <laughs> they all just converged to the ball, to the middle of the field. All we had to do was whack it out there, and it was easy try but the we missed uh, the conversion so a bit of a bit of a misplay there for the for the kicking as uh, we attack down the blind side Daniel Tupo is that a good game and he's gonna take it on the inside a pretty pretty nice try pretty easy try honestly we uh, we were going we were feigning to go to the open side but cut back to the blind and uh, sort of exploiting the fact that Austin is a fullback he is rated well in this game but probably Jack Wyden would be a little bit better if he was playing at fullback, so you know, we'll let's take it around uh, Blake Austin there as uh, Pierce through the dummy, he was through the hole. I pass it back to Napa though. Uh, the play is still continuing though. Ferguson here tries to take on uh, Austin there, gets tackled one on one as uh, Orbison, our dummy half, gets it on to Terrapo again. And last tackle, we'll see what we can do. Napa onto Nicarima going to the point side, so goes for the little chip. What is that kick? Napa gets the bat down, and it is Josh Hodgson picks it up. <laughs> that kick, banana kick of a lifetime right there, just outside the boot. Somehow got it back to the middle of the field. 
as uh, we're looking to spread it right here. Napa onto Pierce, just uh, streaks around there, gets a great ball to Tupo, and it's a foot race. I think it's, uh, who's that, maybe Papali chasing, and that is a nice try, honestly. It was good work by Pierce. He, uh, he skipped to the outside of the defense here. As we watch it on replay, Dylan Napa gets the early ball out to him, and uh, one on one, or well, two on one with the fullback, just drawing pass. And uh, Daniel Tupo down the sideline. He was not going to get caught. I think it was Josh Papali he was chasing. And uh, a good solid, good solid try. And it looks like a good solid win. There is no way the Canberra Raiders are coming back into this game. Uh, about 30 seconds left. Should be, should be the last set of the game as we look to attack off the kick return. Tupo again. He's had a big game. Goes for the chip kick, and he's actually he's got a dive on the ball, so we made a little bit of ground there. <laughs> the chip kicks, dude. But uh, Orbson here, our dummy half, throws an absolutely shocking ball, but is Jaden Nikarima onto it? He gets absolutely met right there, but the the pass went astray, but it almost it almost paid dividends. As uh, a nice little inside ball to Pierce, out to Kenny Dow, gets it onto Tupo. Tupo cuts off the right foot, and scores his fourth try of the game. Four tries in nines. That's a pretty decent effort. And it was a good way to finish, you know, entertain the crowd a little bit more. It's been a, it's been a, good, a good tournament. We've had a pretty decent decent time of it. You know, winning, winning the final, you know, obviously not, uh, not the biggest achievement. Like I said at the start, the nines is pretty easy to win, but, uh, you know, it gets some combinations going. Uh, play with some new recruits as Cody Nikarima, uh, Penny Terrapo, Lisa Mao. Uh, a couple others, I think. I, I can't remember. I can't remember. There were, I think there were a couple other forwards, but yeah, there we go. Mitchell Pierce holding up the trophy. Hopefully, that's a sign of things to come in the regular season. Stay tuned for that, and I'll see you guys later.